Hi guys, Jim Webster back again with a, another edition of Shopping Cart Integration. Today I'm going to do Shopify. This video is going to cover the very popular integration that we have for Shopify. So we will complete the integration, show you how that's done, as well as we'll do some testing of standard commissioning. This is gonna be a two-part series. I'm gonna do a, a second video after this one talking about per product commissioning as well as coupon code commissioning, two of our advanced commissioning structures that are built in, but I wanna do two videos to keep these videos kinda uh, short and on point. So uh, with that said, let's get started here. We'll, the first thing we wanna do is the actual integration. We wanna get uh, Shopify talking to IW Affiliate after all the sales are completed. So to do that, first thing we wanna do is come over to our IW Affiliate Admin Center and go to cart integration here at the top, shopping cart integration wizard, and we're going to find Shopify in the list of cart systems we integrate with. Continue to the next page. We've now enabled it. This button here is gonna give you the very specific instructions for Shopify. That said, I'm not gonna walk through, I'm not gonna read all this. You can go through these step by step. That's why we're doing the video. I'm just gonna go over and show you exactly how it's done. The one thing I might uh, suggest, take this URL, we're gonna need it here in a second, copy it because we're gonna paste it over here in our Shopify center and I'll show you where. Here over at Shopify, we wanna to go to settings in the bottom left, notifications, scroll down to the bottom and you're gonna click create webhook. And right here in the URL is where you're gonna paste in that URL you just copied here from your IDEV Affiliate Admin Center. So you can pop that URL in there with a copy paste and then in the event, you're gonna pick order creation and you're gonna hit save webhook. I'm not gonna do it because as you can see right here, I've already got it set up for you. We did this before uh, starting the video up just to make it a little quicker and easier. Once you've done this, that is quite literally all there is to the integration. You are now integrated with Shopify. At this point, technically you could launch your affiliate program and know that everything is gonna work exactly as it should. That said, I'm a skeptic. I like to see things working. I want to do some testing and see how all this you know, works once we've completed this integration. So we're gonna do just that right now. We're gonna move into testing of commissions. So over in our right of affiliate admin center, I just wanna show you, we've got a couple affiliate accounts set up. They're just test dummy accounts. Um, there's a little bit of traffic in the log. I think there's one click I've already done. Again, moving the video along. There's a couple of commissions from previous uh, testing we've done with other shopping cart systems. So at this point, you know, realize that you're going to have, your affiliates are gonna be out there marketing for you. They're gonna have their own uh, unique marketing links that they're doing this with. So they'll have their marketing links out in, you know, different websites, social media, blogs, forums, email, you name it. There's a ton of different places they'll be marketing. So for the purpose of this video and to see the commission process working, we're going to take an assumption that a customer has just clicked on a marketing link provided by one of the affiliates and the customer after clicking that affiliate link has now wound up at your Shopify store. Okay, so now at this point, we are tracking that customer to that referring affiliate via that link click. And if that customer makes a purchase, the referring affiliate's going to get a commission. In this case, the link that was clicked is affiliate ID number 235. So again, getting back to the store, let's assume we're the customer, let's place an order and see what happens. Let's buy this Apple. The Apple is five bucks, a little expensive, but uh, we'll go with it. We're gonna check out here and we're just gonna do a complete checkout just like normal, like a normal customer would. What I like to do is I like to enable, um, you know, uh, a check or a money order or um, COD, something like that. Make it quick and easy. Um, if you can do that, great. If not, you'll probably want to set up like a $1 test item maybe to, to do some live purchases if you, if you need to. So anyways, I'm going to complete this order. Subtotal is $5 for this Apple. Shipping is $55.55. Again, very expensive. But I want to do that for you for illustration purposes. I'll show you how. Uh, because I want to show you that we only commission off of the actual products in your in the cart system. We're not doing anything with shipping or taxes or anything. It's a sub, it's a true subtotal amount that we're generating the commission for. So we've completed the order. The order number is ten seventy one. So everything in your Shopify admin center has worked normally. I mean, of course, you'll see the order here in your list just like you normally do. 
But what happened over an iDev affiliate? Let's take a look. If I come over here to my commissions on the left menu, you'll see pending approval is zero, but let's click on it and see what happened. You'll notice it now says one. That's a good thing. We got a new commission in. You'll notice it's 1071. If we look at the, v the, the details, you'll see it came in from Shopify. It's a $5 amount. Now, our commission structure in our affiliate program here for this demo purpose is just set to 10%. We're paying a 10% commission to our referring affiliates. In this case, again, 235 because that's the affiliate li whose link was clicked on by this customer. So again, a $5 sale amount, 10%, you got a 50 cent commission. So there is uh, the commission processing working um, you know, in, in a test after completing the integration. And you can do this test yourself too. So completing the integration, as you can see, all of about 20 seconds, then just go ahead and click on an affiliate link, walk through a standard checkout process, just like your customer would. You should see a commission just like this one. Thanks for watching guys. I'm going to move on now to again, per product commissioning and coupon code commissioning. You might want to check out video number two, because those are some advanced, really fun uh, types of commissioning stuff you can do with Shopify also.